And again, you can mix and match your own oils uh, based upon your hair and what your hair likes and, and what it takes hold to. No. What? Hi guys and welcome back to my channel it's just Janine thank you guys so much for coming back and watching another one of my videos today in today's video I will be doing a DIY hot oil treatment I'll be showing you guys some of the oils I'll be using for the video and why I chose these particular oils so if you would like to see how I put this little concoction together just keep watching so we're gonna start mixing all of our oils into a small glass bowl Once all the oils are blended, I'm going to put it in an applicator bottle and you can choose any size that you want. So the first thing I'm going to do is grab a handful of the vitamin E capsules. I say about 10 capsules will be about enough and I'm just going to pierce them and start to extract them in the bowl. As you can see, I'm purposely not measuring any of these ingredients, mainly because I know my hair may take a different amount than someone else's hair, so I can't really say or give an exact amount because everybody's hair is different. Just eyeball it based upon what your hair needs. So after boiling some water, I'm now going to place my oils inside of a hot bath and this will allow the ingredients to blend together and also to intensify. With the oils being heated, this will allow the pores in your scalp to open up and also your follicles to allow a better absorption and penetration. So right now I'm going to start massaging the oil mixture into my scalp and get that blood circulation flowing. So I finished putting all the oil on my scalp and I just massaged it in just to kind of penetrate it and get it absorbed into my scalp as much as possible. But I'm going to get up under the hair dryer for about 15 minutes, maybe 30 the most, uh, just to penetrate uh, the oil even more, just to get it stimulating uh, my hair follicles and get it stimulating um, circulation in my scalp. 
blood flow and everything so I'm gonna do that right now but um, after I get done with that I'm going to shampoo my hair because for those that have been following me and know Sundays are my wash days so this is kind of a, a pre prep pre prep pre prep <laughs> this is a pre prep uh, before I actually start to wash my hair I don't do hot oil treatments a lot um, very rarely do I feel like I need it. Um, today I just felt like I needed it and I want to just try, of course, some uh, other oils and just mix some things up just to see, you know, what my results uh, will be. But um, after I get through with the hot oil treatment, I'm going to actually uh, shampoo with a different uh, shampoo this time. So the last time I did a wash routine, I used, I think, the Hosk um shampoo so today i'm going to try something different now i'm a big fan of design essentials i love design essential products so i said let me look and see what they've got in their line if they got anything new so i picked up the natural almond and avocado moisturizing detangling sulfate free shampoo <laughs> and what i love about design essentials is they don't have any parabens or sulfates um no petroleums no mineral oil so you know, a natural, pretty much natural, really um, great natural product for natural hair. And this oil is running down my back. <laughs> so I'm going to have to hurry up and get up under the... Whew. So I'm going to try this shampoo. I, this is my first time using it. Um, I, this is the first time I will be using it. And I will definitely do a follow-up video just to let you know my thoughts and reviews about the... Design Essentials Almond and Avocado Moisturizing and Detangling Sulfur Free Shampoo. Yeah, I really love, like I said, Design Essentials, and I have no issues or problems. I've, it, it's always been good to my hair. So I have no issues or problems with Design Essentials. I'm really, really excited to try these products. They've never given me any problems with their products. Everything I've used has always worked well for my hair. So the great thing about these products is it says um, on both of these that it saves up to 30 minutes detangling time. So with the products that they have in here, it helps to minimize a lot of your own uh, manual detangling. Um, so this kind of helps to ease those curls and kinks and stuff. So that way you can work the product through without having to really use a lot of your uh, combing and detangling method. So lifesaver here because I hate spending a, spending a lot of time detangling my hair on my own before I apply any product. So it's nice to know that there's a product that will do all of the detangling for the most part for you to kind of get the bulk of it out of the way so that way you can get into starting your wash and your uh, conditioning routine. These products also offer all hair types so if you're one, two, three, four, yeah, did I count right? One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Me is the mix between a three and a four, more so leaning on the four side uh, for my hair. So this is really great. I'm just introducing them today, but I'm actually going to do a review on these after using them just to tell you my thoughts and my initial reaction of the experience with these two new products. So that's it for this video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed watching me make my own little DIY hot oil treatment. So you can mix and match a lot of these oils just based upon your hair type and what your hair likes or what it doesn't like. You can kind of play around with it and make your own DIY uh, hot oil treatment. So I'm going to be playing around with some other oils in the future. Uh, the next time I do a hot oil treatment or even if I just want to just have just a nice daily oil to use on my scalp. So I'm going to be playing around with some different oils and I'll be bringing that to you guys and just showing you some different things I'm mi mixing and matching uh, along the way. So if you like this video, please give a big thumbs up. Please comment and subscribe and don't forget to click that <coughs> notification bell. It's just Janine. I will see you guys on the next video. Happy hair growing. Bye.